Shalom, call hello Allah, Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shah, Waha, we're called Kodash. Um, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who were well and say, teach us to the hopeful elect that teaches truth sincerely across the four corners of the earth. And this is just a little basic lesson a milk, some milk scripture, you know, one of the Akim inspired me to do, but through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shah. And I hope this would be edifying to a elect brother out there. But this Hosea chapter 4 verse 6, my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge because thou has rejected knowledge. Yeah, man. Um, Two thirds of Israel, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Seminole Indians, um, Jamaicans, Haitians, Puerto Ricans, Cubans, you know, y'all are destroyed for lack of knowledge because y'all rejected it, man. You know, y'all had a chance to get this knowledge, man. E either if you've seen us out there on the highways and byways and, and your ass just kept walking, you looked over, it just kept walking, or you didn't look at it, you just kept walking. If you was across the street somewhere, they didn't really see us, but you kept walking. You know, you had a chance right there, but you rejected it. You ain't you ain't trying to take heed to it, you know? Or if you're on Instagram, you see your brother post on Instagram, it could be so simple. I could like somebody's picture, and if they see my like, they mark, man, you know, or a comment, they mark. They could have clicked on my Instagram to see what I got on there. YouTube, you know, y'all might slide past the video like, oh, this ain't a lot of views and keep going. Y'all rejecting the knowledge, man. So, and they say, I will also reject B. So the most I go reject your ass, man, because you reject his knowledge. That thou shalt be no priest to me. Yeah, y'all ain't worshiping him. Y'all not being no priest. Seeing thou has forgotten the law of thy God, since y'all forgotten the law of Yahweh, you know, I will also forget thy children. So he don't forget about your children, man, you know, you and your children, man. Because what happened when two thirds killed Yahweh shot? Well, when they got him killed, they said, let his blood be on us and our children. You know, talking shit. So the most I forgot about y'all and y'all children. It's Ezekiel chapter 38. It's like it's Ezekiel chapter 33, verse 8. When I say unto the wicked, O wicked, thou shalt surely die if thou doest not speak to warn the wicked from his way. So, yeah, you you wicked two thirds, y'all will die if y'all don't learn from y'all, if y'all don't get out y'all old ways. You know, if y'all don't turn from y'all old ways and come to your heart by Shemiah was shot, y'all go die. That the wicked man shall die. In his iniquity, but his blood will I require at thy hand. So yeah, if, if we if we not out there warning two thirds, um, they being wicked and shit, they blood will be on our hands, man. Cause we ain't warn them, man. You know, we we we, we basically killed them for real, man. Cause we ain't get, we ain't warn them. But verse nine, nevertheless, if thou warn the wicked of his way to turn from it, so if we warn them. You know, out there doing our work, posting videos. If we warn them um, to turn from it, if he do not turn from his way, he shall die in his iniquity. But thou hast delivered thy soul. So, yeah, if if, if he don't turn from his way, um, they go die in their own iniquity, man. You know, they go die on their own because, you know. They ain't turned from their way. It's not our fault no more. It's their fault because we weren't them. It, it's, it's just like, say um the stove is hot, right? And you tell somebody, don't touch that stove because it's hot. You know, you weren't them. So it's, so it's not your fault no more because you gave them a warning. But say 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 they want to go touch the stove anyway. That's their fault because you told them not to and they did it anyway. You know? Or like, say it was some dogs outside loose, and you told your kid, don't go outside, you might get bit by a dog out there. You warned them, right? But if they go outside and they see it start messing with the dog and they bite his ass, that's they fault because you warned them already, man. You know? So it's going to be two-thirds fault why they, why they about to die, man. Because we gave them the warning and they ain't take heed to it. But this second Chronicles chapter 36, verse 16. But they mocked the messengers of Yahweh. Who is the messengers of Yahweh, man? The prophets, man. And despise his word and misshoot his prophets. So they, they, they said, fuck, they, they, they said, for, they said, forget this word and they mocked the prophets. That's what that word misshoot mean. 
until the wrath of Yahweh arose against his people. So until the wrath came, you know, just like the times of Noah, until the flood came, you know, that wrath came, just like it could be like this time. It's going to be like this. Just It's just going to be with fire until that wrath come to, uh, and rose against his people, rose against his people. Till there was no rem remedy, and that word remedy means healing. So when that wrath came, it was no healing, no all. Oh, oh wait, save me! No, the doors of repentance closed now, baby. You know, it's time for death and destruction now. And that's what they—that's what two thirds doing. We warning them. They mocking us. They saying that ain't true. That they've been talking about that. But when they come, it's gonna be over with. It's gonna be a wrap, man. But yeah, I hope this video was edifying. Oh, hello, hello, Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh, Shah. Um, Waha, Rakoa, Kadash, Prakata, Devil, Honest, the Apostles, and Elders, a Great Millstone. And see y'all next time with another lesson. With that, I'm going to say Shalom, Ababa, Ba.